Hi dolls, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new, you know what to do. Go ahead and click the subscribe button below and become part of the pink fam. My name is Z and I love to do tons of lifestyle girly, home and fragrance related content. So if that's something you dolls are interested in, go ahead and hit the bell notification to be notified every time I drop a new vid. Okay love, so in today's video I am super excited because I have been itching, I mean itching, to do some decorating to do some updating to do some cleaning you guys if you know me and you follow me for a while you know I love to change my space around all the time like I'll change something around and then like a week later I want to change it again like that's just the designer and the artist in me so I want to change around my office now I already kind of started updating it I took all of the Easter spring stuff down and I kind of want to just give it like a revamped I don't want it to be themed like I don't want it to be like summer themed or you know what I mean like I don't want it to be anything like that I just want it to be a nice space that's creative that I can work in so we're gonna get working on that one of the main things I wanted to do was either paint or add some wallpaper to the accent wall that my desk is sitting on um, but I don't think we'll get to that in this video because I have not decided yet if I want to do wallpaper or paint and I haven't also decided on what color well we know what color I want to do <laughs> I haven't decided on what shade I want to do what shade of pink I definitely want to do kind of like a light pastel pink but I don't know if I want it to be like this wall in my rooms pink or if I want it to be more of a muted light almost white pinky color I'm not entirely sure because I have the itch to just want to paint the walls white so we're gonna see but for now we won't be able to do that in this video but I wanted to tell you guys that to keep um, that in your mind when I'm updating the office that that wall will probably end up being like an accent wall that I will definitely show you guys and update you guys on probably on Instagram or TikTok which is why you should make sure you're following me over there because that's where I do all of my daily updates okay so the next thing that I wanted to do was I wanted to add some cute type of cozy vibes maybe some string lights maybe some LED lights behind the computer monitor I don't know I'm just thinking something cozy with twinkle lights kind of like this vibe but in the office um, just something to make me feel cozy and comfortable because I have the um, habit of getting up from my desk and going and working on the couch which I don't want to do that anymore I definitely don't want to mix the places that I relax with my workspace so I'm trying to separate those two and I think that if I made my office a little bit more cozier maybe I will just automatically go to the desk instead of to the couch with my laptop um, the next thing I wanted to do is change some of the wall art around on the walls there was this big painting over the um, we have like a coffee bar in the office and above that we put like this cute painting of buildings I actually want to take it down I want to scrap it I don't like the vibes anymore it's really giving me very much rustic vibes and it's just not me especially not for the summer like we, we're gonna have a hot girl summer okay and I just I don't like it so we're gonna take that down off the wall I do have this pink painting of cactus that I think is super cool I got this I think from Ross if I'm not mistaken a while ago and it used to hang up in my bedroom but it just doesn't fit my vibe in the bedroom anymore so I did take it down and I'm thinking it might work in the office so we're gonna see about that there's also these um, memo boards on opposite sides of my desk that are super cute and I want to spray paint the letters gold um, and I also am thinking about spray painting the frames of those as well so that's an option and yeah other than that there's not anything too big that I want to add I did pick up some things from Amazon for my office revamp so I'm gonna show you dolls that right now hang on let me grab it <laughs> here's the box boom she's a big okay so oh this is in the package but this actually has nothing to do with the office it's just a rubber pink silicone 
phone or camera case. Um, I did order this, but then it got lost. It was some confusion with the package, so then they sent me another one, and then my neighbor came down and was like, hey, I got a package that's yours two weeks later. So now I have two of these things. Um, so you guys are wearing one, and then I have one right here. They told me not to send it back, so I'm just I'm gonna keep it. I do plan on getting a new camera soon, so maybe I can use it for that as well. I'll be keeping this one as well, but I just need to get like more of a smaller size camera that I can vlog with. Hopefully that'll fit on it. Okay, so you guys already probably saw this on my TikTok and my Instagram because I did an unboxing. And you guys, I love that video because I use the Toy Story audio. If you guys are on TikTok, you guys know what I'm talking about. I got this bag. Um, this is my laptop carrying case. I needed a new laptop bag, you guys. I actually have one that I've had for years. It's a black one with pink and gold ombre sequins on it. It's from Victoria's Secret Pink. It's so cute, but I just feel like I can't take it everywhere with me because it's very, very bodacious in a way. And I just feel like it's not, I can't take it to like a business meeting. Like I can only take it like if I'm going to a coffee shop to work. And I just felt like I needed a new bag, something a little bit classier and cute, but just, just screamed boss lady and that bag didn't scream boss lady that bag was giving very much college student vibes I might actually end up posting it on my Poshmark because it's in very good condition um so check out my Poshmark if you guys are interested in, in shopping my closet I got this one off of Amazon it's so incredibly cute it's by the brand Eco Suzy. Um, I've never heard of this brand before, but it looks like they have very good quality. There is like these buckles on the side because there's a strap inside that you can use obviously to carry around, but it has this really pretty bow and it came with like instructions on how to care for the bag. They said not to have it in sun, to like how to clean it and all of that. It was really, really nice. There is a pocket in the back. Love that. So yeah, it has two buckles right here where you can there press it to unlatch it. I'm not going to open it up right now, but I love this bow. You can also remove the bow if you're not a bow person or if you're not feeling the feminine vibes at the moment and you want to go a little bit more plain Jane, you can remove the bow. But I just thought that this was very classic and very business oriented. Um, this also comes in black and brown if you guys are interested. So if you want a different color, you can get it. And I believe this was around $40 if I'm not mistaken. Again. yeah it was around $40 and yeah I thought about getting the black one and then I was like mm, really though <laughs> don't be basic the next thing that I picked up is these sunglasses case and it's a nice warm pink toned color exact color as the bag I needed something to put my sunglasses in and also my reading and blue light glasses so I picked these up and I'm hoping because it is kind of flat but I'm hoping it'll fit my larger size sunglasses as well. Super cute. You guys can't really see it because the freaking light. Let me turn the light down so you guys can see a little bit better. Okay, you still kind of can't see. Okay, so like, I don't know you guys. I'm trying to get it so you can see. But yeah, it's just a light pink color. I'll probably post up a picture on Instagram for you guys so you can see the like actual color. The next thing I got is these premium digital, um, they're like computer cord organizers. You stick them, they're like tabs that you stick to the back or side of your desk and you can organize your cords. I hate cords. I absolutely despise them, but I need them. So I have to just kind of try my best to make them look cute and organize them. So of course I got the pink ones. This is the little bag. I'm just going to pop one out. One, because I actually want to see the color and I want to show you guys. Okay, so it's like this really cute pastel pink color. I hope you guys can see that. But yeah, it's a really cute, like light pink color. It's the same as the bag. So those are cute and you just pop your cords into them and they have like the sticky on the back so you can stick to the to your desk, to the wall, whatever. And these, how many come in these? I think four, wait, three, six come in a pack. It's a six piece if you guys are interested. Six piece chicken nugget. That's my bomb right there. Six piece chicken nugget meal. Mm -hmm, yes, ma'am. 
Okay, so then I also got some desk accessories because I have been trying to edit a lot more on my desk and my desk is kind of high up. What ended up happening is I rest my um, wrists on the edge of the desk and I noticed I've been getting really bad wrist aches. So I wanted to get something for my wrist and I found this set. It comes with like a mouse pad, a wrist set, a wrist rest and two coasters I don't need the coasters but they came in the set so I just took it um, the mouse pad I don't need technically for my desk because I have a large mouse pad on my desk but I do need a mouse pad that I can take with me um, to go edit on location like you see guys my nails and so I have to use like a wireless mouse sometimes with my laptop to edit my videos. And sometimes I like to just come in my room and close my door, especially when Bunny is like filming his podcast stuff with his partner. So I'll come in here and then I'll need like a mouse pad and I always use a book. So I thought I could just use this nice pink mouse pad. And a good thing about this is it also has like a wrist rest, which yay. I think this was around $17 or $18. Here's the keyboard wrist rest. And oddly enough, you guys, the coasters don't really match the material that it's made out of with the wrist rest, but I get it because the coasters have to be able to get wet and the wrist rest, I guess they don't. They should have just made it all water resistant like the coaster, but it's okay. Come with two coasters cute pink and then that's the back of them so I guess I could use those somewhere and then last but not least you guys I picked up some scissors because the scissors that I use are for my crafts and they are dull and breaking and rusted so I needed some new scissors and I was looking for pink scissors and the only pink scissors I could find is like the generic pink ones with the um, little breast cancer sticker got these these were I believe seven or eight dollars for a pack of three and they come with these cute pastel colors they come with a lavender a mint green and a really pretty baby pink so I'm gonna put this one at my desk I'm gonna put one in the kitchen and then I'm gonna put the lavender one with my craft supplies so I have one in each space that I can use but yeah you guys the box is empty so that is it let's go ahead and head into the office I'll probably speed up some parts and then i'll probably stop and talk to you guys and speed up other parts so it's going to be a, that type of a vibe for this video so yeah if you have a project you have been putting off this is definitely 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 for you to get up girl and start working on that project we can work on it together grab your tea grab your coffee grab your water girl grab everything you need and let's get into this freaking video okay bye bye okay let's go to the office and get to work Pink paper doll. Hi loves, it's me, your girl Z, and welcome to my channel. All of my social media will be linked in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and of course, don't be shy, subscribe. Hit the bell to be notified every time I upload. Okay doll, so I put the letters on this little cardboard sheet and I'm just gonna take these outside and I'm actually going to spray paint them on my patio. I always use like an empty box to do that. So I'll show you guys what I mean. I put it inside this box. And then this is a spray paint that we're gonna be using. Okay, you guys so a little bit of a dilemma well not a real dilemma but I'm thinking if I should spray paint the frames what do you guys think I want to spray paint them gold but I'm like is that too much um, I actually do like the natural wood look so it's kind of like I don't know plus if I'm going to end up painting this wall pink in the future I don't know if it will look like too much with the gold 
or I could paint it white to match this frame, but then I also feel like that's just too much at the same time. Should I do gold, white? I definitely can't paint them pink because the board is pink and the wall is gonna be pink. So comment below, you guys. This is something that might not get done today because I might have to wait until I see what I do with the wall before I can paint these, but I'm kind of feeling like I wanna paint them. Like I don't like the raw, I don't know that I want the raw wood look with my desk. I feel like maybe gold. I also am thinking about moving this out of here and or painting the frame of that. So I don't know, I just don't like this uh, gray here. I feel like it's not the vibe for me. But I guess I could like put some different material here. I guess I could get some pink fabric and just hot glue it there. Maybe that's a vibe. Okay, so I'm getting some ideas. Um, yeah, I have to charge you guys and then we're gonna come back. So. What if we put this here? Or is that too big? For there? I feel like it might be a lot over here to hang that right there. I don't really know. So maybe Ray or Gabrielle, one of you would like to sort of give a brief on what is called Class A program use. Those are the sort of uh, network commercials uh, into digital platforms. And what we, the way we accomplished that was to create a new category of digital use mm -hmm. for streaming platforms. And these are the platforms that are increasingly displacing linear television in terms of viewership. Uh, it's, it's often the case now that uh, Must See TV is on Hulu, on Disney Plus, uh, on Amazon Prime, on Peacock, on any of these services that are now uh, taking the place of what used to be network broadcast over the air television or delivered by cable television. And so we created a higher value category of use. Um, a, 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 a really 
there was two forms of adoption taking a memory not to let go of for some of the people who used to do that and then for the people who are uh, young who are working in the industry all the time they wanted to see no harm no foul but they're all of us but it is the present for them right now so where there was a potential divide of uh, beliefs it was an idea to changes in the current structure otherwise you know we can't do both and so um, having the ability to really do that in a way that doesn't cause, um, you know, deep uh, problems for people who are continuing to have their work used in traditional forms of media while this I talked to. So we were able to get links. have this cute pillow that I bought last year for summer and I just brought it back out and I'm gonna add this to the chair it looks so cute it has all of these like palm leaves on it and I just think it'll look so summery yay actually like that look I think I'm gonna add my mug oops dude I'm gonna add this mug over here just for drinking so I have these two Raydon plant pots that used to have pinkies plants in it they had like a wheatgrass and a um, catnip plant in it for her to eat off of but I actually ended up throwing away because they were attracting bugs oddly enough so I want to try to put some cute plants in here but I'm not sure where I can put these um I thought maybe the shelves but I don't know okay it's kind of like not it like i'm trying to you guys see it okay so like i don't know i feel like it's a little too stuffy yes pinky hang on guys pinky wants to get outside yeah you guys i don't think the plant pots really have a particular space it could go I mean I could put other things in here but my desk is already I feel so full of stuff that I just don't want to add anything else like I could I have like this with paper clips and stuff in it I guess I could put the paper clips in there but I just feel like it's pushing it I also feel like I don't need two plants like that's a lot like I just don't need it okay so you guys unfortunately we're gonna hold off on putting these plant pots up i might end up selling them on makari or my poshmark actually i'm probably gonna transition everything over to poshmark instead of makari because makari sucks i'm gonna put the phone case away so i'm thinking of adding this like mouse pad for my wrist i'm actually gonna add this mouse pad on to the um coffee bar over here because this is where i sit to work on my laptop so it just makes more sense for me to do that instead of well actually
sentir la musique. Je peux sentir le jazz, ça, ça me fait quelque chose. Et la musique classique, ça vous fait quelque chose Oh, pas tellement. La, la musique classique, c'est pour la tête un peu. Et le jazz, c'est pour le corps. goes to the beautiful queens down below thank you girlies so much for commenting on my videos and supporting my channel i say this all the time but you guys really do inspire me i love you and i can't wait to see you in the next video